everyone, I'm Colleen with Awaken Catholic and this is Awaken the Saint. Saint Genevieve was only seven years old when the Holy Bishop of Auxerre, Saint Germanus, was passing through the city of Nantes, France. Amidst the throng of people who had gathered to receive the bishop's blessing, this small peasant girl came forward and confided that she longed to dedicate herself to the Lord. Filled with affection for this little future saint, Germanus took the young girl to a nearby church and with the witness of the crowd, she was consecrated a virgin. A few years later, both her parents died and Genevieve was sent to live with her grandmother in Paris, where she developed a reputation for holiness through her prayers, acts of penance, and practices of devotion. At the age of 15, she met the Bishop of Paris and asked to become a nun. From that moment on, she prayed unceasingly and fasted from all food, eating only two days a week, a practice she maintained for over 30 years. Genevieve was respected and admired for her acts of charity and penitential life, which led her to perform miracles and even to prophesy. She also received visions of heavenly angels and saints. But when she began to share these visions and experiences publicly, the people started to turn on her, accusing her of hypocrisy and false visions. In fact, the people were so stirred up that they actually planned to drown her in a lake. But Bishop Germanus stepped in and silenced those who falsely accused her. After this, she was appointed to look after the consecrated virgins of Paris, where she quickly inspired her fellow nuns towards greater holiness. Then in 451, Attila the Hun's army was marching its way toward the city of Paris. Naturally, the people were ready to flee, but Genevieve convinced them to remain in their homes where they should fast and pray, assuring them that the city would be protected. Miraculously, through her intercession and the prayers of the people, the Hun army suddenly changed course and left the city unharmed. Years later, Paris was besieged by the Gaul King Kilderic. Undaunted, Genevieve passed through the siege lines in a boat to a nearby city and brought back grain for the starving people. She then pleaded with the pagan king to spare the lives of his prisoners, and the king, moved by respect for her, granted the request. Genevieve's life was one of heroic virtue and faith that produced many miracles. When she died at the age of 89, a church was immediately built over her tomb. Even centuries after her death, Paris continued to experience miracles thanks to her intercession. The most famous of these occurred in 1129 during an outbreak of the burning fever. The sickness was ravaging the city and doctors were unable to stop people from dying. It was then that the shrine of St. Genevieve was carried through the city to the cathedral and anyone who touched the shrine during the ceremony was instantly healed. The fever stopped spreading and only three people died in the entire city. The patron saint of Paris, Saint Genevieve's life should teach us that with God, all things are possible, especially when dealing with things beyond your control, like an incurable disease or the threat of war. When it seems like all hope is lost, never underestimate the power of fasting and prayer. If God is for us, then who can be against us? Saint Genevieve, pray for us.